Good day everyone, I'm John Spastan in the Cruz from Grade 6 St. Eugene. And today, I'm going to be showing you how I made my homemade tocino. Chicken tocino might confuse those unfamiliar with Filipino food culture, as tocino technically means pork, or more specifically, the belly part of the pig. In the Philippines, however, the term tocino is associated with the process of preserving meat in sugar, salt, and spices, and includes any protein cured in this type of marinade. Tenderize the chicken breast. Put the chicken breast in a clear plastic and use a meat tenderizer to tenderize it. Pound the meat under a bit thin and tenderized. After tenderizing all the chicken breasts, cut them into strips and put into a large bowl. Alright, so these are the ingredients. First, we need 500 grams of chicken fillet. Then we have 1 third cup of brown sugar, 1 fourth cup pineapple juice, then the salt and pepper are both half teaspoons, and the ketchup, which is my favorite, it is 2 tablespoons. Alright, so this is the chicken fillets. Then we're gonna add the brown sugar first. And then put it there. Then we have the pineapple juice. Just gonna add. Distribute it evenly. And then there. Next, we're gonna add the salt. And finally, we're gonna add the pepper. Alright, so. We have the ketchup, we add it in, get a spoon, then scoop up all the ketchup and push it in there, in the mix. Then, so at least most of all the ketchup will get in. Next, we got to do this. We're gonna mix it well and massage the chicken at the same time. You just you don't know the smell of this thing. It smells really good. All I smell though is my ketchup, which I always smell. So I have a pretty good nose for ketchup. So we're gonna do that and then. Alright, so it, it has been clean wrapped. Chicken, the chicken has been clean wrapped. So I'm gonna put it on the refrigerator and, and let it marinate in there for 4 hours or maybe even overnight.